Uh, this issue right here is the most bipartisan complaint as legislators that we have gotten. And I'm sure many of my colleagues sitting here at this table today uh, receive this complaint. Constituents want us to fix the roads. That is one of the biggest issues that we hear when we go around this state. This is, those are some of the, uh, the majority of the calls that we get to our offices every day. Uh, and, and I have to say during a political season, uh, Madam Chair, we are definitely hearing that message right now. Uh, what this amendment would do uh, would put $150 million into our roads. Currently, this budget that we are getting ready to pass today leaves about $150 million in general fund on the table. And I don't know why we can't put that funding into our roads. Uh, again, this is one of the most serious issues facing us. We have crumbling infrastructure here within our state, and we have a responsibility to fix the roads. We have to stop putting Band-Aids on gunshot wounds. We're appreciative of the $175 million that we put towards the roads, but it's simply not enough. It's not sufficient. And so what this amendment would do would put $150 million in general fund that's being left on the table from this year's budget into our roads and have it fund directly state truck lines, uh, county roads, city and village roads using the funding distribution provided in PA 51. So Madam Chair, I move this amendment. I would hope that the members of this body would support me uh, with this amendment considering that is one of the top issues in our state.